goes that young man, Dane Dill, Damian Lillard, knocking down the triple. Here's Rivers out front, and Jokic hits the deck. Didn't appreciate that contact. And boy, temper's starting to flare early on. Officials doing their best to keep control of things. And I didn't think there was a lot there. Uh, you know, Nicola will embellish. And there was a little shove. I take that back. Carmelo with a little 90s bump there. <laughs> you know, when you cut across that lane, you used to get hit with the forearm and Carmelo delivered one there. GA back in your day that was barely glanced no, from that the officials. Even been a foul. <laughs> and, and now it potentially could be flagrant. And and I think because of the escalation of the intensity and the physicality they're kind of forced to have to look at that whereas otherwise I don't even know that they would address that play but for what had happened earlier. I'm for triggers a possible flagrant foul. All right, so Carmelo Anthony whistled for the common foul. And now they're going to look to see if there was a little bit extra there that the extension of the arms. Yeah, you know, I, I don't think flagrant because two guys fighting and he does push him, but he's in his lower back. Now, if that's up near the head, no doubt about it in terms of it being a flagrant. But again, officials are human and they can be influenced by what's going on in this game. And the one thing you don't want from an official standpoint is to lose control, especially here when all eyes are on you in the postseason. Carmelo Anthony, who was so pivotal for the Blazers in game one, 18 points against his former team, 12 of which he scored in the first five minutes of that game. A couple of big shots down the stretch. Our officiating crew, John Goble, Ben Taylor, and Michael Smith. And we're about to get the announcement. Upon review, a flagrant foul penalty one has been assessed to Anthony. All right, so there you hear it. Flagrant foul one on Anthony. And so Nikola Jokic will step to the free throw line with 533 left in what has been already an entertaining opening quarter. Entertaining and intense, right? There's, this thing is so important, really, for both teams. The NBA playoffs on TNT brought to you by State Farm for surprisingly good rates like a good neighbor. State Farm is there and by Burger King. What's better than an impossible Whopper? Getting a second one for just one dollar now at Burger King. So Nikolai Jokic, the odds on favorite to win the MVP.